Hi, welcome in. September 25. Let's go to God's word. Verse 4 today. And the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Philippians 4, verse 7. Jesus. Luke 8, verses 22 to 25. Jesus calms the storm. One day, Jesus got into a boat with his disciples and said to them, Let's cross to the other side of the lake. So they set out, and as they sailed, Jesus fell asleep. While he was sleeping, a strong wind started to blow, and as the waves washed over the side of the boat, it filled up with water. The disciples woke Jesus, saying, Master, Master, we're going to drown. Jesus got up and said to the wind and waves, Be calm. At once the wind died down and the big waves flattened out. Then Jesus said to his disciples, Where is your faith? The disciples were amazed and afraid. They said to one another, Who is this man that even the wind and the waves listen to him? Can Jesus calm stormy emotions too? Emotions are feelings caused by things that happen around us or things that happen to us. Some situations can make us feel peaceful and happy. Others make us feel sad, embarrassed, angry, or afraid. On a windless day, a, sail, a sailing boat goes nowhere. A boat needs some wind to take it from one point to another. But windstorms can cause a boat to be tossed around like a cork. At times you may feel as though you are in a storm because of something that has shaken your confidence. It may be a problem at school or maybe there are changes happening in your life. Jesus calms the helpless feeling of being thrown about by waves of trouble. Although your situation may not change straight away, Jesus can bring peace to the stormy emotions in your heart.